Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and welcome back to another video, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about why you need to level up Endurance in Oblivion. Some of you professionals know this, and you can just click off. This is more for the noobs, the ones who see this thing and they don't know what it does. So to give you some context, Oblivion has a very bad system, honestly, of uh, helping you with level ups, and that is every about 5 to 10 levels, I don't know the specifics, they bump up the enemies. They, like, scale with you. So there's absolutely no point, really, in leveling yourself up from level 1 because the enemies are going to be just as hard as if you level up to level 50. It's kind of strange, but I don't know. It's the way that they do things in that game. And endurance is quite important because it increases your health. It it That's why it's important. Every time you level up, endurance will... Uh, you, I believe... You, the game takes 10% of your endurance and adds it to your health. So it's extremely important that early on in the game, your endurance is leveled up and you get all that health because, I mean, you could even be a character that doesn't tank stuff, that just kind of runs around and does whatever, dodges all the stuff, and you're still going to need health because an enemy is going to end up hitting you. And I wish this wasn't the case. You know, I wish that in Oblivion there was like, um, what do you call it? Different, different, every single cave and every single ruin was, like, a chance of, like, rolling enemies, like, say, 15 to 25, level 15 to 25, right? That's the ideal level, and it has a chance to roll enemies within that level set of, you know, whatever druids or wisps or something, Deidre or maybe goblins, and it did it that way. I wish that the game was that way, and there's mods that change it to do that. But it's not. In Vanilla Oblivion, if you're stuck on something like Xbox 360 or you don't want a mod, that's what you have to deal with, is you got to deal with that endurance. So to level up your endurance, very simple. Very, very simple. Wear heavy armor, block as much crap as you can, and repair everything at every opportunity. As long as, uh, as well as pick, uh, a, a, uh, I think it's a birth, it's birth sign. I keep calling it star signs. The birth sign that increases your initial endurance and... If you want an extremely high endurance, look up, um, if you ever look up the Oblivion Wikipedia, pick something like an orc, high endurance right off the bat, pop the warrior symbol, and then just level up your endurance to 100. That quite simple, honestly, and that's all this video really is. There's nothing more I can say. It is quite a one-off topic, but in that case, guys, this is why you need to level up endurance, is because Oblivion has crappy level scaling system. Thank you. Thank you. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for sometimes in-depth, sometimes one-off Oblivion tutorial type things. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I will see you in the next episode, stream, or vlog of whatever I decide to make.